Well, for more than seven decades, a local high school class ring has been on quite a journey around the world. Eyewitness News reporter Brandon Goldner explains how a Dutch Army officer made it his mission to personally return a piece of history to a Delaware County family. Ah, finally. So good to meet yes, you. Yes, so good finally. to meet you too. It's a meeting 70 years, three continents, one ring in the making. It feels like Lord of the Rings, you know. I have to give it away, you know, but, but it's so precious. This precious class ring belonged to Melissa Jenkins' great uncle, Joseph Sullivan, a 1946 graduate of St. James Catholic High School who fought in the Korean War. How the ring ended up in the Netherlands is, yeah. That's something we will never know, unfortunately. What we do know, during the war, a Dutch soldier somehow got a hold of Sullivan's class ring. He then gave it to a different Dutch soldier, who shared that story a few years ago to Dutch Lieutenant Colonel Jos Hoon. He made it his mission to return the ring. Using its markings as a guide, he discovered it came from Chester's St. James Catholic High. The Alumni Association posted a photo of it on Facebook, which Jenkins immediately recognized as her great uncle's class ring. And I'm happy that I can bring it back to the family. Despite pledging allegiance to different flags, Lieutenant Colonel Hun says American and Dutch veterans share a close bond, especially after World War II. You fought for our liberation, so, so we think we should always do something back for American veterans. So I'm very happy and honored to be here. We very much appreciate um, all the time you took, all the communication, your tenacity. It means a lot to us. The end of One Ring's journey, only the beginning of a lifelong friendship. In Eddystone, Brandon Goldner, CBS3 Eyewitness News.